Yeah. So we're in uptown Victoria. We were in downtown Victoria. We got mid extreme levels, but we're very concerned about this consumer area. There's a mega tower over here. There's one just over here. You can just see the top of it there. We're gonna go over there. And we just discovered this right there. So scan around to the other. You see this up there as well. So there's three installations in this consumer residential area. We're concerned about the EMF radiation on the beautiful people from Victoria. You know, this is a very uh, pristine, you know, the island is uh, a beautiful environmental area, right? We, so we want to make sure that we protect it, preserve it. Uh, we're going to do our first reading to see what's going on with the EMF. Look at that. It's pretty high. Oh my God. Is that coming from the one over there? It's coming towers? from those two towers and that. and that one. So we're at 5.92. It's almost maxing out here in this public area. This is volts per meter. And this side we have a microwatts meter square. This is the average power output. Thermal, thermal, we're going up to 5,000. The bio initiative says it should be around 1,000 in public areas. So this is non-thermal, this is thermal. This is a dangerous EMF radiation zone. And we got the health food store there. Let's keep walking. And that is in line with Uptown Medical Offices. But this is this is what's happening to the people in Victoria. They, they don't even know what's happening across the country. We're concerned. But let's get uh let's look at these other towers. Okay. You hear the sound? Oh my God, this is really high. These people are getting radiated in this public area. You hear that sound, eh? Yep. The higher that frequency sound, the, worse the, radiation. the higher the EMF radiation coming out of it. And you know, as everyone knows, all radiation is harmful. And uh, Unfortunately, the government of Canada through Health Canada is covering this all up for the sole purpose of protecting the telecommunication industry to bring their technocracy to Canada. Okay, now there's stairs here. There's stairs here to get out to the street. I don't know about up there. Okay. tower look at that monstrosity there where right there ahead oh okay Let's... can you zoom into that absolutely there yeah. we go yeah, that's horrendous so that's uh, this meters peeking out right here in that's the at the area. entrance coming into town look at these people walking they don't even know what's hitting them not at all this is blanketed emf radiation uh the average power outputs up we're getting over 5,000, 6,000 now. Uh, Let me see. The peak right. signal's peaking at 6, is pulsating. You see that? Yeah. No, you it was that? better down there. I could see yeah. it better down there. You see that? It's peaking out. 
It's pretty bad. Okay. This thing is max. Right here in line of travel of that thing. This is max at six. These are obscene readings. Uh, the average power output is almost over 20,000 now. The bio initiative said it should be about a thousand in a public area. Crazy. This is crazy. Look at that. Look at it. These people are getting radiated. Big time. Let's keep moving. Can you zoom in though to that monstrosity again? Yeah. Look at it. <coughs> oh my god. What? Look at that right there. Look at that. Unbelievable. This is unbelievable. Where is it? This is absolutely unbelievable. There's another one. This thing is maxed out. It's completely maxed out. Yeah. The ball. Yeah, this is obscene. I've never these, these readings are off. Look at that. Unbelievable. Make it zoom in here. It's unbelievable, the readings. Yeah, it's better, I think, without that. It's a I'm really sure. serious EMF zone here. So got a whole triangle. A triangle of it. Yeah. Wow. We're at the corner of Cary and Ravine you know, right now. Yeah, look, there's the city there. So this is all residential here, isn't it? A mix? Well, yeah, there's residential on the other yeah. side. This is the mall. This the is mall, the... The mall complex. Yeah. And there's that nasty tower there. There it is. So this is uh, pretty consistent with Calgary now. Is it further? But the readings are, the readings are unbelievable. I wouldn't be living here in a heartbeat. I'd stay away from this area. I'd sad to say that, but why would you subject yourself to this, right? Yeah. I, I don't know how you're feeling. I got a bit of a headache being here. Yeah, I got a headache. And these are the, you know, the, the short-term mild. I got. I actually have body pain. Do you? I do. Yeah. I'm really sensitive to all this nonsense. This is pretty serious stuff here. Look at that. But let's let's go around. before the cars come. Okay. And there's that other tower, so we got a triangle effect here. Yeah. Wow. That's a nasty tower down there. But, oh my God, these readings are off the charts. I'm getting 45,000 microwatts per square meter. Um, the thing is stuck at six. The meter stuck at six is so high, the radiation coming out of these towers. It's unbelievable. Wow. This is serious, dangerous zone, EMF radiation. Uh, uh, people can't, it's kind of a hidden danger. The government's covering it up, but there's a lot of independent science on it. It leads to cancer, blood disorder, oxidative stress, cell death, and we don't even have 5G in. 
Just wait till 5G comes. Well, uh, some of the 5G is in. It's in, but they're doing spectrum switching, so it's not really live. Not fully, okay. Well, once it's fully live and implemented, I, it, it, it's going to push this even higher. Of it's going to be very dangerous here. Yeah, I heard they're not getting rid of anything else. They're just adding. They it's are on. adding it's to it, but eventually it's just going to be all 5G. Okay. 6G, right? Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. So, uh, come let's over, walk come a little Come closer. over here. Just come over here for a minute. She was annoyed about the camera, so let's come over here for a bit. Yeah, yeah, this is Max style, but let's keep walking up here. Okay. Can you zoom in close so they can see Two. it closely? Oh. There we go. And that's not residential. What is that? I don't know what that is. But this whole community is being radiated all the way over there. It's up The girls haven't crossed the street yet. Oh, maybe they're not coming here because, oh. uh, yeah, because uh, she's having problems with her pacemaker. It's completely maxed out. It's just stuck at six, so it's above that. Yeah. 0.5 is the threshold of health, adverse health effects, and we're stuck at six. Okay. This is deadly zone right now. Uh, we're getting over 20,000 microwatts per square meter, well above the public standard of 1,000. Mm -hmm. This is a residential area here. This is an apartment building. The readings are the readings are unbelievable. And this is the corner of Cadillac and Cary Road. We're heading towards the Apex building here. It's unbelievable. It's just stuck at six. What? This is blanketed radiation. It's just stuck there. You see it, eh? Wow. It's stuck. So these people living, living in, in this, this in this apartment building are getting completely radiated. Are getting completely radiated. I wouldn't be surprised if the cancer rate's way higher in that building. Oh, totally. Yeah. Yeah, I, I got a whole like bunch. There's a clamp on my head. Just be careful. My whole body is achy. Yeah. I don't know how much longer I can do this. It's getting. Yeah. I'm like not feeling well. So we'll do. We'll do another reading here. Uh, it's completely max. This is sickening. Okay, so there's the building, the apex. This is even even in 5G yet. This thing is completely maxed out. It's going up to 44,000. Microwatts per square Yeah, meter. it changes all the Look, time. Look, it's stuck here at six, so it means it's above that. Yeah. It's very bad. Look, there's people living here. Yeah. Look there, some kids up in that apartment. See the windows? Yeah. You know, Happy Canada Day. See it? Oh, that's for the, that, yeah, those are hearts for the healthcare yeah. workers. Oh, are they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You see that, eh? Yeah. It's terrible what's happening to these people here and people living there all around here. You could go within two kilometers of this. Yeah. But I never thought I'd be seeing this in Victoria. We were downtown. They're mainly rooftop towers. Yeah. And we got one that's on the ground there. And this is rooftop. Rooftop over there. It's sickening. Yeah. People, please get aware. This is real stuff. There's lots of independent science. Going back to early as 1971 on this, uh, the Naval Medical Research Institute out of the U.S. put out a report warning about microwaves. 1977, the Soviet Union put out a report on millimeter waves. They were testing on humans and animals and very serious effects. Yeah. This is real, deadly stuff. 
And why is our government doing this to us? Uh, they're in collaboration, full collaboration, as they say on their website, with the telecommunication industry. That's what it's about. It's about profit, money, control. Profits before Canadians. They're complete, completely detached from the health and well-being of the Canadian people. Do you want to say something about your alliance? Well, National Citizens Alliance, uh, you know, we see the big picture on this. Yeah. Uh, you know, we know this is beyond 5G. We know this is ushering in the technocracy society, uh, AI society. We're going to lose up to 40% of our jobs. We're going to have mass uh, facial recognition surveillance. Uh, we're going to have no privacy. And we're going to be, EMF radiation is going to be even higher. So how do people find the National Citizens Alliance? Uh, go to their uh, go to our website. We were just censored on Facebook. Uh, uh, they don't want the truth out. Uh, I just got a three-day ban. So go to our website, nationalcitizensalliance.ca. We got a beautiful blog with tons of factual information. Uh, there's all kinds of videos on our page. Uh, we have a YouTube issue, cam, uh, channels as well, so check those out. But, uh, you know, we're starting to get censored because... They're, they're afraid of our message. Yeah. Well, good on you. Thank you. That's good.